Hey, Sausage Sleuths, it's me, your favorite Sausage Sleuth, Joe. Welcome back to Last Train to Blue Moon Canyon, a Nancy Drew mystery, this time on Mega Senior Sausage Sleuth. Toot toot, mm. all aboard. <laughs> all aboard. Thank you so much for that sound clip, Jonas. I do appreciate it. I feel like it's becoming tradition to start off each one of these with a reverb fart sound. <laughs> Thank y'all so much. Uh, we're back here, held captive on this train. I have to tell y'all something. It's the dolls. From a doll to the dolls. I'm not doing this. Cause I was looking, I have Game Boomers open and I can tell you, name of the dolls. I want you to sit down. I want you to shut up. And I want you to learn something. Razor Bunny Gemini, thank you for that sound clip. That's exactly what I want y'all to do today. With these doll these dolls in particular. Not this is the cast for Drag Warrior 16. <laughs> oh! Chantilly. Their names are Chantilly. Okay, tag yourself, chat. We have Chantilly Hildegrad. Oh, she's already right here. Uh, next up, please welcome to the stage Awful Ursula. Death to all of them. <laughs> <laughs> that Perfect timing! Thank you for that sound clip, Sing Sang Sunk. I appreciate that. That I was a, a German dictionary. Kind of a I jump speak scare. A little German myself. Hello. <laughs> Tommy Day, thank you so much for that sound clip as well. These look these look like old German dolls, don't they? This is some um old maiden type of dolls. <laughs> this is sickly Sarah. Tag yourself if you're sickly, Sarah. That is actually me. We have Edna the Terrible in fourth place. We have... That wasn't a sound clip. That was the fucking doll. We have Edna the Terrible. We have Teddy Eberhart as number five. Ooh. Teddy's looking rough. Um... In sixth place, we have Sadie Crawford. She's pretty boring and nondescript, I guess. She's definitely an old maiden type. <laughs> In seventh place, we have Hagar Anderson. Hagar Anderson. That's how you actually say it. And one of his eyes seems to have slipped. In number eight, we have Thomasina O'Neill. And she is, oh God. <laughs> okay, I might be Thomasina. Look at her. Okay, why is she wearing Bratz doll shoes? I'm sorry. Why is she wearing Bratz doll clunky heels? What the fuck is going on in here on this day? Meeple Trees, thank you so much for that sound clip, because that's accurate. She's wearing Bratz clunky heels. Chunky clunky heels. And she goes here. In number ninth place, we have Yawning Alice, who is right here. She's yawning. Wait. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> she's doing something. She's doing something. In number 10, we have Naughty Tina, who seems to have fallen and broken her head. And then this is Eliza Sandberger. What's up with that? <laughs> Alexa, thank you for that soundbite. I do appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. What is up with that indeed? So we've got an old maiden type of scrapbook. <laughs> Seriously, what is this? Oh, I want the mirror. Really? I can't look at any of the interesting things. I can only look at the non-interesting things. Okay, work. Oh. Yes? We'll talk some more later. Keep me posted. Yeah, you can only look at the collage. That's so upsetting. But finally, I have some more, um, coins is what they're called. And that's not, 
And that's not the sound they make. It sure isn't. Taylor and Lynn, thank you for those bits. I appreciate it. Deep breathing exercises and big playtime. Now, what did I... I wrote down something here. It says orange, blue, green, red, purple, yellow. That must have been for something I already did. On this page, I have written down Tina face crack. I want to go see what the numbers were for all of these things again. So all I obtained is the new coins. Are they slugs? What's a slug? Is that something you put in a gun? Oh, no. We have Joe Spacey Redeem say nice things about the chat. Dear chat, if y'all were asleep in the sleeping car, which is this one, I would sing you the, the gentlest song from outside your door. <laughs> I would sing you the gentlest song, that one. This is a song that never ends. Yes, it goes on and on, my friend. Some people started singing and not knowing what it was, but they'll continue singing it for it was because it is a song that never ends. Yes, it goes on and on, my friend. And I would just say, I would sing that very softly outside the window, outside your door. <laughs> Is this a cry for help? This old <laughs> Not the remix. I could beatbox it. I'll, then I'll start beatboxing it as well. Thank you, Sing Sang Sung, for that. I appreciate it. Also, Kitsuna me, thank you so much for the first time sub. It's great to have you here. I do appreciate that. Thank you so much. So the square is four, the duck is one. All right, just refreshing my brain, retraining my brain. I'm glad y'all like the sound clips. I really like them. You know, we'll, we'll eventually cycle out the fart sound, I'm thinking. So I need to make four. Oh. Oh, with all of them? Uh-oh. Oh, no! Oh, no! I'm stupid! Oh, oh, I need to make it with three of them now. Oh, I remember this. This is with one coin, with two coins, with three coins. And I just heard w the Trixie one. We can try it. Oh, Kit Moss, thank you so much again for the bits. Yeah, I'll post them. Um, I'll just, I take a picture of it. I'll post it in the Discord. Yeah, um, those of y'all on YouTube, I now have access also to, uh, Caitlin sent me Nancy Drew Mega Mystery 4-pack CD-ROMs, which has the original Secrets Can Kill. So I'm going to try to get that working as well. Very excited. I've seen some clips of the old animation. So, um... Looking forward to that. So now I need to use four coins and get one. This isn't right. I, I need to not use this one. I have an idea. I just got the one in the... Okay. And now I need to... Three, two, four... Uh, oh! Four, three, two, one. Four, three, two... I need to minus three, but I don't have a three. And I can only use one more token. Well, I played Pokemon Stadium on the... In or on the whatever... Did it come out in 64? Um, but I haven't played it yet on Switch. Is it out on Switch? Not three, two, three. Why are y'all screaming three, two, three? Seven, six, five, four. Oh, but I need to use two, three of these. Four, three, two, one. Oh, that's negative seven. There, with any luck, I just opened the stove in the dining car. Y'all were really rooting against me there, I know it. 
Y'all were really rooting against me, as usual. Jenna Devlin, thank you so much for the bits. Always great to have you here. Taylor, <laughs> thank you for the bits again. I appreciate that. Not and. Wait, you thought what was going to be interesting from the memories? James Thurston. I hereby agree to pay James Thurston the sum of $9 a week plus room. Rich people never pay enough. Plus room and board in return for his services as the engineer in my train. Wait, why do I care about that? Is there anything else in here? Any old timey stuff? So that's just been in there for for 900 years. The dinosaurs left it. Well. I hated that. <laughs> hey, how's it going? I think I know the oh, name yeah. of Jake Hurley's engineer. James Thurston. I needed to know that Great. for some reason. What else do you know about him? Well, nothing. Good. Good? Yeah, finding out more about him will give us something to do. We'll look into it. Thanks, bud. See you later. You know where to find us. I don't remember why I needed more to know questions. that. Oh. I should get going. All right, then. We have a would you rather from R Rev Dot. Would you rather wax Frank or wax Joe? Well, we call them the wax twins in this game, correct? So I'm assuming not you don't want me to wax them like put turtle. Is it called turtle wax that you put on your car? You don't want me to put wax on them, but which one I would. I like better. We're also going to assume. Oh, also, I looked it up. So I don't know how old they are in this game. Um, but we're gonna, we're gonna assume they're in their 20s. Like, we're gonna, yeah. Um, Frank probably is more, um, I don't know, Frank? You used to say Joe, now you say Frank. Also, I looked it up and Lori Gerard is in her 20s. I thought she was a teenager. She sure is not. She sure is not. Wax then poetically. <laughs> Um, you're gonna have to get chat GPT to wax poetically. Thanks for the chat. For you. Come back anytime. Well, I think I'm... I think I might be Joe Hardy. I'm the twink Hardy boy. And so I, I'm not gonna pick Joe. Yes, I thought that's what y'all were telling me. Someone in the chat last time was like, she's a teenager. Dated uh, Balducci? What's going on? It's been great talking to you. Don't mention it. But then I looked on the Nancy Drew wiki and they were like, she's she's 20. She's in her 20s. I don't know. I thought she was like a, um, a young heiress. I mean, that's true. I would say she looks and dresses like a teenager. She looks like a, um, well, I mean, she's more put together than... I was when I was a teenager, yes. I guess. But this outfit is giving... Well, this is what I wore in high school. <laughs> a beret. A puffy pink vest. I'll come back later. Keep me posted. I need to make a phone call. Yeah, and I was, that's exactly what I wore in every Hello? picture. Hi, Bess. Hey, what's going on? Exactly. Charlena and Lori had this big, huge argument, and you'll never guess why. Uh, oh, yeah. Lori called Charlena a hack. No. Uh, Charlena called Lori an airhead. No. Um, Bess, she doesn't really want you to guess. Oh, okay? she is giving Ashley Tell Tisdale. Well, it seems that Lori sent Sharpe. Charlena a bunch of story ideas, one of which Charlena used in her latest book without telling or paying Lori. Charlena stole something Lori wrote? That's incredible. No, the fact that Lori wrote something that Charlena thought was worth stealing. That <laughs> Drag was her. Slay her. Sipping on that true tea. 
gag. Makes me think that Charlena is a lot more devious than she appears. Yeah. <laughs> Lori's yeah. right behind us. <laughs> Get this, it turns out that Tino Balducci pulled the emergency brake. Balducci did it? He framed John Gray so he could arrest oh, him. Oh, H.N. Walls, welcome. Himself. I think welcome, it finally dawned on him that he's not the great detective everyone thinks he is, and probably never will be. How pathetic can you get? Yes. Pathetic. Just my type. Not this, Bess. No. Bess said cute and pathetic, just my type. <laughs> Chat. That's chat. <laughs> chat is best. John Gray claims to have every single Drew and Nancy Drew game. Did you hear it? I heard a woman singing, but it was very faint. You heard an actual ghost? Bess, whatever I heard was barely audible. For all I know, it could have been a voice off the radio or something. Did the real Camille like to say? <laughs> yeah, According well, y'all are Charlena, best. She did. Well, there you go. You heard a ghost. Oh, Bess, you are so gullible. Open my gullible. Have y'all ever heard Catch a ghost? Later. Okay. Well, George, back to work. Uh, Batty Rowan, thank you for the biz. Nine dollars a week is now two hundred and seventy-one dollars. Oh. And Gigi's confirming this kinda. Uh, thank you for the bits, Batty Rowan. Gigi says. Nine, so it's two seventy one sixty five. Oh, so that's one thousand and eighty six a month. Oh, the average was like three dollars. Still underpaid. Still underpaid. Jake Hurley, penny pincher. Did he die penniless? He wanted to hoard his treasure, didn't he? Kit Kat twenty seven ninety three. Thank you for the bits. Farfield, thank you for the bits. Charlene is Charlena is Charlene Char, is Charlena or Charlene? Anyway, she is not 20. Velvet Max, thank you for the three months, not this. And Brit Steps, thank you again for the bits. I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. Wait, I'm being serious when I say I how do I stop the train? This might be a dear chat moment because as far as I'm con concerned, the mystery saw <laughs> Isn't it? Uh, dear chat, give me some hints to my next move. There's an engineer driving the train. I have to do the word search. Oh, is there something in my inventory that I didn't do? I love that this scrolls down, but I didn't. Not taffy on the tracks. Read the... Oh, is this about that letter I didn't read or something? In Read the letter in the cab... Not in the cabussy. I, I thought I did read it. But y'all know me. The Kabussy. All right. Use your favorite weird. All right, chat. What's your favorite weird ussification of a word to talk about? A hole on it. And we'll see which one of you gets auto modded first. Okay. Oh, I, did I pick up a letter? What do you mean the letter? Was there one over here that I'm just... Oh, this. Oh! Okay, so I have to find... Yeah, y'all aren't getting auto-modded. This is upsetting. 
Not this. Okay, so these are the words I have to find. The ones that are under, underlined. Underlined. I forgot this was here. Thanks for reminding me. It was a really long weekend. My parents came and visited, and I just kind of... My brain has been wiped since last Tuesday. Jed, I said, thank you for the bids. <laughs> Ready to solve those murders. What murders? The ones we're about to do. Wait, dear chat, is it these words? Are these words I'm supposed to find? <laughs> no! Up one? <laughs> no! It was... <laughs> Almost. There's a puzzle in Lori's car it goes with. I passed it. <laughs> Have I seen it before? Second second page, wrong wrong letter. I only have these three letters. Middle letter. Not this one. This is the dancing one. Okay, I need to listen to one person only. It's this letter. I don't have a German dictionary. I speak a little German myself. Hello. <laughs> Thank you so much, Razor Bunny. I feel like we're speaking two different languages right now. Second page. <laughs> Thank you so much, Razor Bunny. Yeah, this is the second page. Top barrier. First, you'll need a map. Oh, it's the cities have taken me all over to which can be difficult. To Calico, Silverado, Central City, Dodge City. Dodge City, Kansas? Virginia City and Tom, but Tom B. Stone. Mm. Now, how did y'all know that? Can I ask that question? Can we talk about that part? Oh, Dodge City, Colorado. There's a Dodge City, Kansas. Tom B. Stone. Oh, they have to be right next to each other? Oh, that's not that one anyway. Okay. So give me a minute to think. So this is... They can't be side by side. They have to continue like this. And that's not a word. Oh, I could almost spell Nintendo. Silverado, that's a type of truck. Central City. I think Silverado is right here. Wait. What, what was that? Go in, oh, go in order. So Calico. Now I can do Silverado. That's not how puzzles work. Central City. Mm. 
Dodge City. Okay, so now I'm doing great. Virginia City! That's not even in Virginia, is it? And Tom B. Stone. No! <laughs> okay, can we talk about how when you click on this tile, it's also partially the back arrow? We need to talk about it. We need to talk about it. I get really scared when I accidentally click backwards on a puzzle. Nervurtsba. Guess I'm done. Strange. All that's left is a jumble of letters. Nervurtsba. Uh, bah. So I need to I need to translate this. Nervous now. Neberged. Oh, Gigi, thank you for the bits. <laughs> Come on, thank you for the bits. Molinday Sauce, thank you for the bits, too. Taylor and Lynn, thank you for the bits. I've actually found several solutions on the Nancy Drew forums before. I can see, you can see some of the old posts. Needs more vowels. Yeah, I agree. Bant. Zart. Zart. Not Bratz Van. Does it fucking spell Bratz Van? I'm gonna, I'm gonna throw a brick out the window. It spells Bratz Van. B R A T Z V A N. It spells Bratz Van. No, I don't want to hint quite yet. Now, did that not open something? I can't click on these, so what's the point? Yes? Bye. I'll be waiting. Train. Train. Sure. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. It's an eight letter word. Okay, so it's just one word. Train. Ba. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's Bratz Van. It's just Bratz Van. Barn Vats. Rang. Rant. Rants. Baz. I mean, give me some vowels. Is it a, a train? I mean, is it a place or a name? It's Bratz fan. Not Brenda did it. Might be a German word. Neither. Is a state of mind. Don't make it harder than it needs me. So maybe that's just it. Is that just it? Oh, I make everything harder than it needs to be. That's why I'm in therapy. Penos. Was Penos from? So that was from Tomb of the Lost Queen. Where are y'all getting your Penos tattoo? Are we all getting penis tattoos and and when? What's going on? You've been a big help. Don't mention it. <laughs> Not no. <laughs> ah! 
When are y'all getting y'all's penis tattoos? Penis? <laughs> when I don't know what to do, I go talk to everybody and then they say they don't have anything to tell me. The Hardy Boys have something to tell me. I know that. Please. The Harvey Boys. My tattoo artist won't get back to me. <laughs> Jenna Devlin, thank you for the three freaking uh, gift subs and the bits. I do appreciate that. Thank you, thank you. Hey, how's it going? Yeah, just best in George and home. I'm not calling home. Whitney, thank you again for the bids and for being here. Brewster wins with the 29 uh, freaking months. I appreciate that. It's always great to see you. And K Stumps uh, with the 14 months. Thank you so much. Able to find anything great to out see you too. Jake's engineer, that James Thurston guy? Good news and bad news. The good news is he had a wife in Copper Gorge, so he may he have had wi -Fi? children. Bad news oh, is wife. Our internet service provider stopped providing before we could use our cell phones to find out anything else. That's okay. We can do more checking when we get to Copper Gorge. Right. Oh, okay. We're about to... Be <laughs> I could not tell you what state they're driving through right now. Why'd the train tracks have to... Ah! The birds were screaming! Copper Gorge Museum and Taffy Shop. Hey there! Welcome to Buell's Old Time Taffy House! Come on over here! Welcome, stranger! <laughs> you by any chance get here on that private train what's parked out yonder? As a matter of fact, yes, I did. There's Not a rumor this. around that Charlene of Purcell's on board. <laughs> <laughs> yes, it is. I've read every single book that girl ever written. Just write her whatever lived. Did she get off the train too? I don't Thank think you, so. Thank you, Shay TV, for busy. that wonderful Charlene sound clip. Sell herself right here in Copper Gorge. I appreciate that so much. Dang. Well, welcome, little missy. Go on in and take a gander at what life was like during the life heyday finds a way. Copper Gorge whilst you sample some of our delicious homemade saltwater taffy. See, I relate because me and we both have teeth problems. See, he's got a gold tooth. So this is some kind of museum? Why, it's the best kind of museum, sister. It's free. You sister. can get and gawk and ooh and ah to your heart's content. At least you can till I close up. Where'd all this stuff come from? Been in the family for years. For centuries. In Not fact. cosplay sub goal. See, Buell was my great great uncle. This building used to be his general store. During the glory days back in the 1880s, he commenced a pawn brokering. So the miners Copper Gorge was crawling with back then could raise some cash to pay for grub and tools and such. But pretty soon, the mining boom went bust. And there was Uncle Butte, stuck with a whole store full of junk. Only it wasn't junk to him. Debris from lost lives and broken dreams, what he called it. Couldn't bring himself to get rid of it. So, passed it on to his kin. My great granddad is the one who come up with the idea of turning the place into a tourist attraction. Yes, Summer Dog Gorge. Annual hot dog eating contest and sausage festival. That sounds fun, actually. Kit Kat Moss, thank you for the bits. Snoo oh, I didn't even see the Snootsonian magazine. Art and Americas. I don't know what the one in the front is. Oh. And you make money. Oh, I wanted to taffy? say this one. Tourists just love taffy. Especially when I you love dangle taffy. a free sample in front of them to get them hooked. Of course, it ain't really free. Some taffy on a stick will cost you two tokens. Which you can get by winning both those games over there. Okay, Rich. Two tokens? Are they hard? Danged if I know. Come to think of it, I've never played them. But you're getting me off track here, Missy. Fact of the matter is, they're free. Unless you go messing with the artifacts I got in here. Do that and you'll be head first in the nearest snowdrift before you know what hit you. Do you know what Jake Hurley? 
We're a Jacob Hurley. Do you by any chance have any of Jake Hurley's things in here? Jake who? Hurley. He was a miner. I think he may have left a lamp and a pickaxe with your great great uncle. Never heard of him. Of course, that don't mean his stuff's not here. Just means you're just gonna have to look around and see for yourself. But remember, Susie Q, don't touch. Susie Q. Ain't talking to you. Be right here if you got any questions. Why is this still really expensive for a hoodie? Something tells me I better not go in there without permission. Oh. That's never stopped me before. So there's the this looks just um, like the insignia I yeah. saw on the train. I'll bet this was Jake's trunk. Now what all do I have? You ain't touching anything over there, are you, Missy? Oops, I'd better go ask permission before I mess with this. <laughs> you still here? Do you know Can I touch that, that? trunk over there? Why? You ain't been fooling with it, have you? Oh, no, of course not. No, I just thought it might contain the lamp and pickaxe that I asked you about before. Well, if it does, you can forget about them, because it's locked. None of my kin have ever been able to figure out how to open it. Not just even break it open. Alan, and he went to junior college. Would it be okay if I tried to open it? Well, now, I certainly ain't gonna let you break it open if that's what you're getting at. Oh, no, I would never use force, believe me. But in order to try to get it open, I would have to, you know, touch it. Nope, sorry, not gonna happen, little missy. Unless. Unless? Tell you what, you get Charlene a Purcell to come in here so's I can shake her hand. Oh, and I'll no. let you fiddle with that trunk till the cows come home. You know what? I've got a better idea. Now, what could be better than me coming face to face with the lady who writes the finest literature this here country's ever seen? Well, <laughs> that's just it. Good if God. If you just meet her, you'd have nothing to show for it. Afterwards, she'd go her way and you go yours, and that would be it. But if you were to I remember this. We have to get her autograph. Well, then you'd have something to hang on the wall and brag about. Okay. Make it so's I can meet her and get her autograph. Oh, but the thing is, she's on a deadline, and if you take her from her wedding, she may fall behind. And if she falls behind, her publisher may pull the plug. And if her publisher pulls the plug, it could ruin her career. Do you really want to risk ruining Nancy Charlene Nancy is Purcell's really career? taking us on a course, no. verbal journey. Right. You just get me Charlene's autograph, and you got a deal. Just make sure she uses my name. I want it real personal like. You bet. And your name is? Fatima, with an F. None of that weirdo pH stuff. Okay, Fatima, I'll be right back. Oh, looks like she's about to say something. <laughs> okay, well, I want to play the game. I love the game. I don't really remember what it is, but I'll probably love it. I'm good at a lot of things, so I'm probably good at this game. Oh, didn't I win it like really fast or something? Me, an actual horse. I've never been to horse races before, but I, you got to cheer. You got to go wild. Oh, I will tell you, I did win a stuffed animal at Rehoboth Beach at one of the um, the arcade machines. The ones where you squirt the water and the things and they run across the track. Okay. Um, Is this random or do I ever learn? That's a goal. Feel goal? It's random. Oh, shit. Not this, Ryan. I don't even That's know. That's what she said. And you know what? I... What was that? Sailor Moon, thank you for that sound clip. I do appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. I don't even know what that means. Well, this one's won twice by process of elimination. Or probably won't. It was if it's completely random, then who the fuck knows what's gonna happen? Should have put it on yellow. I love mustard. Loser. Oh, that'd be a good sound clip. Nancy going, loser. 
Jesse, baby, thank you for the six months. Glad you got to pop in. Great to have you here. Taylor and Lynn, thank you again for the bits. I appreciate that. I have to win twice. No, you need two coins for Taffy, don't you? That's why I'm continuing to play. I'm not Ooh. dumb. Didn't she tell me I need two coins? Oh, there's another game. Listen, y'all are really rooting for my downfall. Oh, this is like Pachinko. Oh. Oh. What was I trying to do? Oh, I was landing on the gunshot. Do I not want the gunshot? I want him to fall straight down. What was that? <laughs> what just happened? Andrea, thank you for the two months. I appreciate that. Uh, Lorelai, thank you for the bits. Would you wear the suit Fatima's wearing? I, I imagine that costs a lot. I mean, I would wear overalls. I will wear overalls and a hat. If that's what y'all are asking. Come on, you dumb donkey. Oh. Ah! Oh! Do I have to go again? Oh, okay, good. Some of the sounds in this game are very loud, and I can't really predict when that's about we to happen. Did it. We did it, Joe. Winky Wonky, thank you for that. I do appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. The sounds are very unpredictable. And now, is the Yeti in Colorado? Because I don't think Yeti's in Colorado. Looks like to get some taffy on a stick, I'm going to need two different tokens. We have a say nice things about the chat redeemed by sugared turtles. Dear chat, if y'all were here with me, I would give you this taffy on a stick, but I would take it at a later date in order to um, use it to get the key at the end. But I would take it later. Yes. You startled me. Do you work here? I do. Are you looking for someone? Is that yes, Tex? Camille Hurley. She died back in the 1800s. Ah, Camille. Beautiful crypt. Wonderful view. Good drainage. Whoever buried her must have loved her very much. May I go inside it? You may, but unfortunately you can't. Why not? I accidentally dropped the key down the grate that's in front of the crypt. If you can retrieve it, you can keep it. I'm having another one made. But if you do go into the crypt, just is this Texas voice? You won't be alone. This sounds like Tex from Shadow Ranch. Let me tell you, they got their money's worth. Well, there's the key. For that fucking creaking sound. I just need to find something that key will stick to. Gotcha. How'd she get it out of there? That was the biggest key I've ever seen. <laughs> I know the key was close and the grate was far, but holy shit, that was looked huge. Okay, Camille. Yay. Any more? I want some of the rocks. You can do like, I don't know, maybe grind up those rocks and make them make some magic in the letter he wrote to his niece jake said she should go to camille's grave and let camille's goodness rub off on her rub as in rubbing maybe 
I don't know if I have any paper for rubbing yet. I have the... I got a pulse pencil. something that'll help me make sense out of all those lines. Oh, I hate this puzzle. Don't I hate this puzzle? I feel like I hate this puzzle. Maybe making a rubbing would help. Nancy really spelling it out for me because she knows how dumb I am. Knock knock. Ha ha ha. Hmm. Ha ha. Looks familiar. <laughs> knock knock. Ha ha ha. Ha ha ha. P B. P B. P B. P B. P B. P B. P B P B P B P B P B P B P B C U P B C U P B Not P B down my leg. So I need to click these in this order, I'm assuming. We'll do red. What the fuck is going on in here on this day? <laughs> Thank you, RevDot, for that sound clip. I really appreciate it. I wish I knew. I wish I knew. Why'd the music stop? Let the music play. Hey, kitty girl. It's your world. Oh, it's back. Red. Green. Blue. Orange. Yellow. Purple. Oh, this says copper. <laughs> I did the one for lead, didn't I? It literally says copper right there. Good God, what's wrong See with me? You. Good God, what's wrong with me today? Green, red, purple, yellow, orange. Can't check that off yet. <laughs> That part. Wingy Wonky, thank you for the sound clip. I do appreciate it. Mess. Ugh, too much pee, pee Have y'all ever used peanut butter powder? You get a little... Pure peanut butter powder. I'm not talking... No additives. It's just ground up peanuts. You put it in your mouth. You put a little water on it. It turns into peanut butter. And it's really good. Kit Kat Moss, thank you for the bits. Brit Steps, thank you again for the bits. And Passion for Fashion, thank you for the five months. Thank you, thank you. I do appreciate that. Green. Gagatrandra. <laughs> right? Winky Wonky, thank you for that one as well. It's revolutionary. You can use it in like shakes and stuff. And I think it doesn't have like oil. It doesn't have like oil, you know. Oil, you know, all. Are we about to see a dead body? Oh. Oh. Well, can I look anyway? Diva, you in there? Are you in there, hunty? Is this the one where I have to put the colors and like the stained glass looking formation because I remember hating that. <laughs> why can't why can't I look at these two? Oh my god, they're gone. Where the fuck did they go? Oh Jesus. 
More questions? I met a huge fan of yours in town who'd really, really like your autograph. An autograph picture would be even better. Imagine that. Me having fans way out here in the boonies. Well, I'm sure I have a picture around here somewhere. But me. what I don't have Me when I go to Virginia. I just <laughs> she go to Costco. I have a pencil here somewhere. A pencil won't do, dear. It has to be ink. See if you can borrow a pen from somebody. Me when I go to Virginia to go to Costco. Me when I leave DC, go to Virginia to go to Costco, and someone looks at me a little too long. Me having fans out here in the boonies. <laughs> Imagine. Ah, oh, Leon Cos Games. Thank you for the bits. The ghost lights? Not science. Oh, I'm glad they changed that. It's not nighttime anymore. Oh, everyone on this car better wake up. <laughs> no. Oh my god. He's gone now, right? Oh. You need to leave. What's up? I really, really need a pen. Could I borrow one from you? Sorry. Well, I'll catch you later. Take care. Penos. Penos? The amount of time it takes to walk up to people, they just must be staring. What's going on? Do you by any chance have a pen I could borrow? Why, I'm surprised at you. Don't you know that every detective should carry a pen? That Actually, part. Actually, I carry a pencil. Well, as it happens, I got lots of pens. I'll tell you what, if you can play that Leaping Lizards game I found over there and do better than I did when I played it, which shouldn't be that hard seeing as how smart you are, I'll give you a pen. What do you say? Sounds good to me. Or I could okay. kill you the and the game nobody would care. As many lizards as you can <laughs> oh. by jumping them with other lizards until you can't jump anymore. Last time I played, I wound up with just five lizards. If you can wind up with only four, the pen's yours. Pin us. Oh. <laughs> That's, yeah, that startled me. When you click main menu, it startled the shit out of me. How it, okay. I'm not on it today. We're, we're on one today. D yeah, uh, checkers. Now, I don't know how to do this. If we're being honest, these things are in Cracker Barrel. And I usually do really good. They have these exact same games and did I <laughs> Oh no, I can do this. They have these things that all the tables in Cracker Barrel. Do they not? Yeah. I mean, I'm just trying to kind of keep it even, keep it light. Keep it bright, keep it airy, keep it the vibes vibing. I don't fucking know. Okay. Oh, I really have to pee. Okay, but we'll try this at least one time before I pee. P pee pee. Pee pee pee. Oh, that sucks. Okay. Well. I got this. Y'all don't taste that? I got this. Bona but Butino Baducci? You don't taste that? That shit in your mouth? I did it! I won! Talk about luck. Here's your pen. <laughs> what if I licked his hand? <laughs> what else can I do for you? You've been a big help. Helping people is what I'm all about. What if I licked his hand? I don't know. Might be something new to do. Might be something new to try. <laughs> his hand, his hands were so smooth. I just wanted to see what they felt like with my tongue. I don't know. 
Oh, might be something interesting to do. Yes? Guess I better get to work. Keep me posted. I could have voiced her. Keep me posted. Right? That was good. Okay, Cat Moss, thank you for the bits again. His mats was so dusty. What mat? Who's mat? Keep me posted. Kind of like a coming from the throat. <laughs> looks like looks like you trying to relax, but having zero idea what it means to feel relaxed. Well, she's rich. She probably is actually relaxed. She bought a train. Have you found a pen so I can autograph that picture? I got it from Tino. You can keep it. If you could have it say, to Fatima, that'd be great. There you go. That's not what a pen sounds like. Is that what a pen sounds like? I, I don't think is. that's what a pen sounds I like. I should get going. That would be nice. That's not what pins sound like. She just tried, she signed it on a wood table with an exacto knife is what that sound was. She Fancy. sounds There you are. We've been looking for you. Yeah, you won't believe the lucky break we caught. Lucky break? Oh, hey, that was the result of good old-fashioned detective Why are these men yelling the at me? the result of your insisting we stop for a cheeseburger. Guys, what's going on? Well, it turns out that a grandchild of Jake's engineer still lives around here. What's more, he hangs out at the local... And now it was too soft. Day. I had to turn it back up. he's pretty ancient. Y'all, yeah, I had to turn the volume from 100. I have a button that turns it from 100 to 24%. And during the middle of their conversation, I had to switch it back to 100% because they started whispering again. Huh. Why are they looking at me still? Ah, and you found that out when you stopped there so Joe could get a hamburger. Cheeseburger. Ah! The, thing is, the owner of the diner wouldn't agree to point the guy out unless one of us fills in for a short order cook. He's got to go home and wait for the cable guy or something. And since Joe here barely knows how to boil water, guess who got the job? Cheeseburger. <laughs> way to go, Joe. Hey, I can boil water. It's just that when it's got things Easy floating burger. in it, I get confused. <laughs> Speaking of confused, get this. <laughs> Balducci convinced Lori that Jake's mine is somewhere right here. That was what it was. So he, Lori, and John Gray are hiking up the mountain out there even as we speak. Like that bumble brain's gonna find anything. Sounds like now might be a good time to do some serious poking around on the train. Good thought. Hey, I better get going. Wish me luck. I'll go with you. You can make me a cheeseburger. They 100% the Hardy the Hardy boys should be a couple if the Hardy boys were made in 2023 They need to be a couple best and George need to be a couple not let's not let's stop having them all be related to each other <laughs> Cheeseburger Thank you so much again for the bits Taylor. I appreciate that Cosmos. Thank you for the bits too. not this Oh, did Nancy say way to go, Joe? Oh, shit. I'll see if I can get that sound bite. Way to go, Joe. I'll see if I can get that sound, that sound bite. Her sarcastically saying that. No, no, they don't need to be related. They need to share a last name because they're married. Pianist Leah, thank you so much for the bids. Glad you got to be here. Got that autograph? Thank got you, thank you. Better. An autographed picture. Hot dang! She spelled my name right and everything. Go ahead, little missy. Have a go with that trunk. I did. Whatever's inside, I did. it's all I yours. wrote, way to go, Joe. <laughs> <laughs> I did write it. What fits here? Oh, is this one lead? That's this chest. I need to match that shape. Is this chest made out of lead? Okay, let's try lead now. What fits here? Oh, okay. What were y'all? Oh, did you, would y'all have preferred during my bathroom break? Y'all left. I somehow left y'all staring at the Hardy Boys again. 
That would have been fun. I know y'all like staring at them and them staring back at y'all. Uh, <laughs> passion for fashion. Thank you for the bits. Taylor Lynn. The sound was at 2 2. Okay, okay. Thank you so much. Thank you for the bits again, too. PB. PB. I'm, I'm assuming that this one is PB. Can you make... I don't think you can make things out of lead anymore. Have y'all heard? Do y'all know about lead? It's a DSLR camera. Well, here's Jake's lamp. Oh. Another slug. Yay! Come in handy. That's not a slug. Slugs are slimy and alive. But where's his pickaxe? Mm, I don't know. Welcome back. Have you by any chance ever come across a pickaxe that had the initials J.H. <laughs> Not in it? a lead paint because sandwich. Because it used to belong to Jake Hurley, and I really, really need it. I thought it would be in that old trunk, but it wasn't. You got that trunk open? Wait till I tell Cousin Alvin. He thinks he's so smart. As for that pickaxe, so happens I got it upstairs in my kitchen. Use a dope and the coconuts Aunt Lucy sends me every year from Hawaii. Do you think I could have it? Is that a reference well, to something? I can't have it. How would I open them coconuts? Do you really think Buell would approve of you using... Hey, I could have just gotten you the autograph and instead I got you an autograph picture, which is way better. Hey, you I could oh, have just gotten you guilt trip. his autograph, but instead I got Gaslight. you an autographed picture, which is way better. You owe me. Oh, okay. I'll let Gaslight, you have the gatekeep, After girl you boss. Something for me. Like what? I got a bunch of taffy over there what needs sorting. Just follow the directions that are posted by the machine. Them belts get moving pretty fast, so oh, you gotta shit. keep your wits about you. This While is like a that, I Love I'll Lucy, right? This like I Love Lucy? Farfield, thank you for the bits. You're talking about the Scooby-Doo movie? Love Scooby-Doo Love Action. Kit-Kat Moss, thank you for the bits again as well. Did I get everybody? Oh, Passion for Fashion, thank you so much. I appreciate it. If I have to. I like doing things, but I don't like being happy doing them. There we go. Not there we go. Is this a lot harder on Senior Detective? <laughs> I almost loaded it. <laughs> Imagine. <laughs> wax paper for the taffy. Would you mind if I took a piece of oh, wax paper? Oh, I need some of that. I could let you have a piece. She took the whole freaking roll. All right. I hate this. This is going to stress me out. Is this loud? What am I supposed to do with this? Oh. Sort them? Blueberry. I should have looked at this first. Oh, reject, rejects. Banana. What's orange? Ma mango? Huh. Uh, huh. Ah. I'm freaking out! <laughs> oh, no! Oh, what's red? Strawberry? Oh, I'm freaking out! I need to stop picking those ones up. Slows me down. They're so little. Y'all, I'm playing this game in 640 by 480. Look at all this wasted taffy. Have there been any grape ones? I, Y'all, I love grape taffy. There's one. I love grape taffy and nobody can come for it. Yes, indeedy. Did I do okay? Can I have the ax now? Got that taffy sorted? No problem. That was easy. You sneak any freebies while you were at it? Oh no, I would never do that. <laughs> well, ain't oh, you the good no. two shoes? Truth is, wouldn't oh, mind too much we, 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 up to it. Here's I the would've. big eggs. Crack the handle pretty bad on the last batch of coconuts. You sure you want it? Positive. There you go. Don't hurt yourself. I won't. Thank Perfect. you. Perfect. 
Now we have the murder weapon. Now the murderer has the murder weapon. <laughs> Perfect. Now the murderer has the murder weapon. Me. Moa. Uh-oh. Hello? Hey, it's Frank. I'm in the kitchen of the diner playing sure. <gasps> I'm Frank? Has that child of Jake's engineer showed up yet? Just came in with this lady who's even older than he is. And get this. He's a retired miner, so every time I finish an order and ring the pickup bell, he thinks it's the mine shaft elevator bell. And for some reason, it makes him start telling his lady friend about his grandfather. You mean you ring the bell and he starts talking about James Thurston? Exactly. Of course, five seconds later, he's rambling on about something totally unrelated, but I just fill an order, ring the bell, and ding, he picks up right where he left off. That is... Unless I fill the order wrong and the waitress chews me out. She's got a voice like a chainsaw. Very distracting. Sounds like you better keep your ears open and your nose to the grindstone. I am. Just wanted to keep you posted. Well, good luck. Thanks. Talk Where to you Where do soon. I think he lives in his body? Probably his head. Y'all, I woke up at 6 a.m. and I read... Oh, what am I doing? Oh. And I read a story about conscious... I read a, like a 20-page article about consciousness. Volcano burger, onion, and oh my god. Now, is this timed? Is this timed? Dear Chad, is this timed? Because I, I can't remember that. I can't read this handwriting. I actually don't know what jalapenos are. <laughs> Those are pickles. These must be jalapenos. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, great. Hot mustard. Prob probably that one. Bacon. Oh, that's going to make me hungry. Cheese. So do you know what you want to order yet, Edna? I'm still looking. Did I tell you that my granddaddy was the engineer on a private train owned by one of the richest men I can voice this. Copper Gorge. Jake Hurley was his name. Yes, sir. My I don't want Frank to wash his engineer. hands before he More feeds me. Years. <laughs> I told my daddy that men don't come any crazier than Jake Hurley or any nicer. Treated my granddaddy real well and told him stuff. Real important stuff. Stuff he made my granddaddy. Oh, I told him stuff. Forget. Stuff that my granddaddy told my daddy, and that my daddy told me. Why don't you get the egg salad, Edna? Eggs are back to being good for you, you know? <laughs> Seems like just last year, all those scientific types were saying your arteries would clog up if you so much as looked at. Yes, sir, Jake Curley told Oh, my I love that made him he never told another living continue soul. Continue on. Not even his wife. I tell you about her, Edna. I don't think so. Camille was Edna name. is struggling, Camille Diva. That's this right. Diva's going through well, it, Hunty. So young that poor Jake didn't have time to tell her anything. According to my granddaddy, one summer day she had a dizzy spell. And Tomatoes and her. jelly? She didn't Pineapple? Heat, see? And sometimes in the summer, when they were going through Cheese. the desert, why that train would be just like an oven. Anyway, granddad said she got right up after Gross. she was okay. But a couple hours later... The way my granddaddy died, that was kind of strange, too. Okay, I ever tell you how my granddaddy is? died? No, I don't think you did. My daddy, he came home from school one day to Everything find a Everything minus the peas. Pickles, peanut butter, pineapple, and pickle herring. He was in the engine of Jake Hurley's train. Just that trying lettuce does not look good. His still on the throttle. The strange thing is, nobody else was on board the train. Yet the door to the engine was locked and barred. It was like Granddad was trying to keep someone out. Good like he was running God. from something. Like something finally scared him so bad his heart just stopped. Of course, he was in his 60s at the time. And back then, I can't listen old. to him and do this at <laughs> the same time. So, old now, does it, Edna? so Here I, am pushing I hope, 93 and I hope Fred, Ned, chicken. Frank. Spring <laughs> chicken. Now, where do you suppose that expression came from? Why not spring goose? Or hey, look, Mr. Temporary Cook Person. If I served this, my customer would throw a fit. Just make me what's on that check, okay? That cook had better get on the stick. I or did. I'm gonna go deaf out here. It says everything minus the pe. Oh, I forgot the fucking bacon. 
These people can eat shit. These people can eat fucking shit. I would squirt that hot mustard into their fucking eyes. <laughs> that is... This is garbage, mama. Garbage. I'm not even... This is also... Am I even getting paid for this? I is he still talking? The mine my granddaddy said Jake heard he'd found. Oh, yeah, I get to do whatever I want. A couple years before he died, granddad told my daddy that Jake found a vein in the I just like cheese and mustard. Himself, so no one would steal it. Oh, I like lettuce, too. He wouldn't even tell granddad where the mine was. Oh, my God. One How many pieces of cheese can I put on this burger? Real slow so he could jump off without granddad seeing him. Then Granddad would pick him up at a prearranged spot a few days later. Oh, they didn't call him Crazy Jay Curly for nothing. Speaking of crazy, you see how much Abner's charging for a haircut at that shop of his now? Twenty bucks! But what's even crazier is people are actually paying him that. I told him the only way I How many pieces is this is so far? With hair down to my knees. He just laughed and said I was a crazy one. Twenty bucks for a haircut? What is this world coming to? Just a little more mustard. Yum! But the craziest mm -hmm. thing he made him swear to tell it to my daddy. And it was so bizarre that I remember it to this day. So I sure don't understand how it has helped. I can't make any more, by the way. I'm locked but into since here. My daddy didn't tell <laughs> me not to tell anybody. This is what Crazy Jake Hurley told Granddad, word for word. The eye of the tiger is fixed on a star. Zircon oh, lies in fingers that scar. Oh, I need to know this. Floats in a hand from the deep. I think she's writing this in her journal, so we're fine. Shall keep. Tourmaline by a soft arm is ensnared. Paradox rests at the foot of the mare. That goes the in, that's where the tiger ah! is fixed on a star. They just appeared. Zircon lies in fingers that scar. Amethyst floats in a hand from the deep. Citrine is what the foul mouth shall keep. Tourmaline by a soft arm is She's snake. repeating it word Paradox for word now the after they told the her. Frank, are you sure that's what he said? I'm positive. Are you sure are that's, you all, sure he that's all he said? Look, this guy was old, okay? I mean, we're talking Jurassic. And guys that old don't joke <laughs> around. They don't no, have time is... to. What That's you what you said. Is what and you I know what? I... Word for word. What was that? Thank you so much, Emily Herps, for that. I appreciate it. Um, So Nancy Drew, she repeated back word for word what Frank, I guess Frank told me, and then we re-repeated re it back word for word. The ageism, Mama. Calling him Jurassic? Got anything else? I almost forgot. You gotta check Buy this American out. Buy American Teen Against Crime. Letter, Frank. You bet it's an old letter from Samuel Clemens. Oh my God! Death Where to did all you of get them. This? Oh. I got this. Oh. Oh. Apparently, he and Jake were pen pals. Thank you, Ryan, for Wish that I sound clip. For I appreciate it. Wish I had a famous writer for a pen pal. Now, this is who? Samuel Clemens. Is that Edgar Allan Poe's pen name? Oh, should I look at it? Oh. When Joe gave it to me, I about flipped. I know I should turn it over to Lori. Oh, and Mark I will, Twain. Just so darn cool. Mark I Twain. Still don't see what the okay, big deal sorry. Is. I mean, sorry. It's, like it's from Mark Twain or anything. Oh, I told y'all I'm Joe. I've even played this video game. I'm j I told y'all, if I were one of the Harvey twins, I'd be Joe. See you in a bit. If you need anything, just let us know. Not Shania Twain's dad. Mr. Twain? Mr. and Mrs. Twain? Oh, it got real silent on the train. I don't like that. Ooh, it's been a little quiet on the train. <laughs> It'd be fun to own a train and have like a speaker, uh, a speaker system installed. Well, I think my favorite part, like, 
I think I would like to be like the a metro a subway car driver, a metro driver. And the in the in some of the older cars here, the not the robot voice, but they announce things manually, like the next stops. So you really have like a captive audience. These people have to listen to you. You know what I mean? And I think that's fun. <laughs> Oh, look, that's what I do here, too. But y'all can leave any time. You know what I mean? Y'all can exit the train. There, those people ain't getting off the train. Do you know what I mean? What is this? thought I did it wrong for a split so y'all can exit it technically at any time I can't like stop the train in a tunnel and hold y'all hostage and a sing glass. do you know what I mean I bet it's the one I need for Jake's projector don't make me sing <laughs> did someone want me to sing wait a minute <laughs> exo pay thank you so much for the uh. 10 months I appreciate that Taylor thank you again for the bits lots of cuts to silence although it reminds me of um Ooh, Stardew Valley has random silence. Um, Leon Cause Games, thank you again for the bits. That girl boss too much, and they mentioned... I feel like I've seen it. I think someone's linked me to it. Wait, did she say the telescope goes in here? Oh, no. That's for, like, later, though, isn't it? Did I get that dead person's thing? I think I did. Oh, I need to go get that jewel now, the gem. Dear chat. Not the crickets. Dear chat, what do I, do I put the telescope over there? I think I put the telescope over there, right? Telescope's part of the steampunk. I haven't done the rubbings yet. No, you're right. You're right. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I was going to put it back. <laughs> I was just going to be really nice and put the thing back, but okay. I need to... I came in here to get the jewel. Oh, and let's see what... Hey, Tino! See what Tino's been up to. Nothing? Hey, Tino! He came back immediately after Sorry. I played the piano. I hear Tino took you and Lori for a little hike today. Don't remind me. Turns out Tino had no idea where he was going. Good thing for him, my fingers were frozen Murder. stiff. Murder. Dino! Otherwise, I would have strangled him. Yeah, I got the carbide from the liquor flask. Thanks for the chat. Goodbye. Thanks for, like, telling me you were about to kill that man. So I have a bunch of coins, but do I even need to use them yet? I think I went the wrong way. Not remix. Farville, thank you again for the bits. Strange before this. Oh, life is strange. Giving me major, major. I thought you were saying it gives you major life. And I was like, okay, work. Okay, work. Uh, Cosmos, thank you for the bits. Well, technically, but I know some of y'all leave before I dismiss y'all. As seen on the viewer count as the stream goes on. <laughs> um, we do have fun, though. We do have fun, though. 
More questions? You didn't go on Tino's expedition to Jake's mine? Please. The man barely knows where his head is. If he's the one who finds that mine, I'll eat my laptop. I would like to see it. I'll let you get back to your writing. Remember, if it's juicy, I want to know about it. Juicy? Okay, hey, wax boys. Oh, no, we're bit. fine. Sounds good. The next thing I need to... Oh, I just want to hear his voice real quick. Engineer, this better be Miss Gerard. Well, actually... <laughs> <laughs> oh, we have a fake Zodiac redeemed from MG Link for Aries. Now, in fact, something y'all might not know about Aries is when an Aries gets mad um not kind of gassy well that's not news though everyone knows that when an Aries oh, I'm not doing that that's the game doing that <laughs> yeah, why is it always about poo poo and pee pee with y'all? I've never talked about poo poo and pee pee. When an Aries gets mad, they like to go in. They like to poop. <laughs> is this even my pencil? Uh, when an Aries, well, it's not even when they get mad. Just in everyday life, sometimes the Aries needs to blow off some steam. And in order to do that, they call a random number and start screaming lists of names from the yellow pages. All Aries have access to the yellow pages. By the way, every Aries has a big yellow pages book sitting next to their corded phone. No. <laughs> Yes, thank you for that. Yes, though, actually. Where they call random numbers and then just start yelling about their problems. Wisdom, charity, purity, eternity. That, that's what I'm going to name my kid. <laughs> Please welcome to the stage, wisdom, eternity, purity, charity. Please welcome to the stage... Not no. That was a good fact. Oh, can I get this? I gotta get the eagle, right? Oh, ah! back already. Talk to you later. If you need anything, just let us know. Oh, Frank is so sweet. I gotta get the eagle. Yeah, I remember that. Okay. Oh, no, no, no. This way. I need to look at the, um, that ugly thing on the wall again. Uh, MG Link, thank you for the four months. I appreciate that so much. Is this a, a different username, name, new other person? Thank you so much, Kit Moss. Thank you again for the bits. I do appreciate that. Who would want this stupid train? I don't know. Someone, um, you know, someone dumb. <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah, let's just take a picture of this. I need to, I don't need to continue walking back and forth when I can just, I mean, I know I can take a picture with her cell phone too, but I like my cell phone better, better, better. All right, let's start, pop, let's start popping open some of these babies. So, one, two, three, four, five. I need the Liberty Bell, which has a crack in it. That if true. I need to equal 12. By using five of these. Are you up for the challenge? Oh, 
that's not the correct way that numbers go. I have an idea, and y'all need to... I want y'all to sit down. I want you to shut up. And I want you to learn something. <laughs> Wait, what? Oh, the two. <laughs> That equals 12. Is this the wrong kind of bell? Are there two bells on this and one of them's cracked and one of them's not? Did I do it wrong? Afterthought, thank I you for you the bit. I want you to bit. sit down. I want you to shut up. And I want you to learn something. Leon, thank you so much for that sound clip. That's the move. And that's the truth. And that's the truth of it. I thought I did this one right. Afterthought, thank you for the bit. Sad if bad, glad if good. Get that tattoo. Sugar turtles, thank you for the bits. Oh, I appreciate that. Thank you. Oh, did you resub and it didn't show up? Thank you so much. I appreciate that. And Uzi V with the 28 freaking uh. months. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. I do appreciate it. That sound clip is from Trixie in one of the uh episodes. I think the round of the random ones. Jenna Devlin, thank you for those bits too. I do appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. I, I'm gonna go ahead and throw a dear chat in here. I genuinely thought I did that right and I don't understand what I did wrong. This is supposed to equal tw t 12. Is there a cracked bell? Is it supposed to be negative 12? Why would you have to do negatives? A, lo a lowercase 12. Oh no, I forgot even how to do this. Oh, I think I remember. Oh, no, I don't. Oh, the bell doesn't unlock anything. I thought I just meant... I thought I just had to get there. Okay, so I don't even need to worry about this fucking bell. Did this happen to me last time? I don't need to do these in order. I'm just dumb. Well, thank y'all so much. I appreciate it. Mm, thank y'all so much. <laughs> so I need to do one, two, three, four, five, six of these and get an eagle. Oh, and the eagle's number is two. Oh, that's fun. That's the number that was right there. Okay. Oh, too bad. Too bad. I got four. There you go. This game can once again... These slugs can once again eat shit. Bell is a red herring. No, it's gold. Eh, ha, ha, ha. I I understand. I know what that means. I get it. More pipes. Why am I not surprised? Uh, Farfield, thank you for the bits. Do complicated art they're obsessed with and after the fact during the process. What? But during it, your brain is... No. No, just you. That's just, that's just you thing, I guess. No, my brain is great. No. Weird. Oh, this one has to go like this way. Well, no, this pipe has to face. Oh, duh. Okay. Remember, before you say anything, make sure you've sat down. You've shut there, it up. That looks right. And I want you to learn something. 
That's all the pipes, right? Shut it up. Kickhead Moss, thank you again for the bits. Baby Olives, thank you for the bits. Taylor Lynn, thank you again. I appreciate that. And Leon, thank you again so much. I appreciate that. <laughs> I run for it. <laughs> Let's save it again. The menu music kind of stresses me out. I blew up the train once before. <laughs> Dad, can we blow up real quick, please? Now, do you want to blow up or do you... Jedi said, thank you again for the bits. You want to blow up or do you want the, me to knock my head and, uh -oh. that and kill myself good. that way? Ah! I would whisper. I would bend down and whisper to the Harvey boys. Better buckle up, you little piece of shit. Loud. Oops. I'd lean down, I'd whisper to the Hardy Boys, Better buckle up, you little piece of shit. Uh oh. Oh, oh! That I doesn't look good. <laughs> Thank you, Joe's Mayonnaise, for the reverse fart. The reverb, <laughs> reverb fart. Remix. Hey, how's it going? See you soon. You better. Reverse fart. Remix! Tell me, fellas! Oh. Oh, wait, do I have all the jewels? Crisscross! Reverse! Reverse fart. Well, it's when you get a straw. A really long straw. A really long crazy straw. So long. Remix! <laughs> Sing Sang Sung, thank you so much for that. I do appreciate it. I need a lamp. Thank you, thank you. Oh. <laughs> okay, looks like that goes there. There's still water in it, which means it must be out of carbide. Oh. There, it should work now. Not this old Tommy projector. Two, one, two. Three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. I got five gems. How many are there? One, two, three, four, five. There's six. That can't be right. That's not right. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five. That's not a hamburger. That's not a hot dog, right? That's a gem. I thought I had another one. Oh, we gotta get like the fucking pipes. steam working. This is where too. Jake's pickaxe goes. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, of course. <laughs> <laughs> What I need is some duct tape. What taffy? How can I repair this? Oh. What's that? Is that how you light the carbide? I keep clicking that instead of the anything else I'm supposed to click. No, oh, yeah, I don't know what that is. We're just gonna pretend it's something. I don't know what I'm supposed to do with that with a stupid um 
Trinity, Unity. Does that go here? Oh, oh God. I hate it. Let's go see what Lori's doing. Yes? Do you know if there's any duct tape around here? Duct tape? Duct tape. Nope, afraid not. Sorry. I hear Tino took you and John on a trip Tino. to Jake's mine. Jake's mine, my eye. We went tramping through the snow, lugging all this equipment John insisted on bringing, and where do we end up? At this teeny tiny, half rotten, tumbled down outhouse. He led you to an outhouse? Well, he said it was the opening uh -oh. to a mine shaft. Dino said but then piss John play. said if it was, shouldn't the hole be going into Which the is fine. instead of just down? So they stood there arguing until Tino finally grabbed a shovel, went inside, and started digging. What he found was definitely not gold. What did John say? He called Tino a moron and a whole lot of other things I'd rather not repeat. I'll come back later. You go, girl. <laughs> <laughs> he found a bunch of turds. He found some turds in the desert. Matt, thank you again. Thank you for the bits. I appreciate it. You go, girl. She listened to the Spice Girls once. What's up? Would you, by any chance, have any duct tape? Got some right there in my gearbox. That's the good news. The bad news is, I can't open the box. It's an Why empty not? box. That oh I found my god! My story I scoped out on my show last year. You can open it with either the key, which I just discovered I forgot to bring with me, or the combination, which you're supposed to be able to figure out. Oh, just this by is looking you the tell box. the story. Yeah. Fortunately, I didn't put anything critical in there. I've never tried to open it without the key, but if you want that duct tape, go ahead and give it a shot. Okay. Thanks. I think I will. If you get it open, the duct tape's all yours. I bet the animals should start from the left shore. Oh, oh my God, they're all dying. That is so me. <laughs> that is so me, though. It looks like the cat goes first. So I'm assuming. Oh no, there's a peacock. What? Oh, and then the wolf's on that side. Oh, they're sw he's switching them up. Oh, he looked at the animals. He looked at the two shores. He looked at all the animals and he said, Remix! It's an old maiden type of puzzle. <laughs> Fuck. I bet the animals should start. Oh, they all start over here. Oh, yeah, yeah, no, that makes sense, too. Okay. Jesus. So, like, probably that one. And then he take the cat over. No, he take the dog over. He take the dog over. No. No, 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 no. I got this. I got this. Everybody shut up. That's the first one. What's wrong with, with what? Is something messing up? Are we struggling? Is something struggling today? What did Streamlabs do? Is the bot messing up? Uh-oh. <laughs> what happened? Oh! Oh, it was blank. Oh, the quotes are being weird. So I think he takes the dog. Oh, but then he took the cat. Oh, that's him taking the cat there. Does he take the cat back and forth? That's the last one. I don't know about this storytelling. I think we take the dog first. But then the cat. 
No, you take the cat first. And then the cat's over there, so we go back. And then... Why would we do that, though? Holy fucking shit. Okay. We took... The cat. And then we left. And now there's more animals. So let's say that we put the peacock. Nope. It may be blank because the quotes don't exist. I don't think any quotes have ever been deleted. In fact, I've never had control over the quotes. <laughs> And I don't really know how to access them. So there's that. Oh, I got it. I got it. I got it. This is where we start. We put the cat here. Is there one with like the wolf on it? Yes. We drop off the wolf. We take the cat back. Oh, shit. Now, what's over there? The wolf's over there alone? We take that and then leave the peacock. We put the peacock there. Oh, but what? what's this? Oh, shit! Okay, stay calm. Oh, why'd the cat get left over there? I got it. I got it. So there's a cat. <laughs> this is them bringing the cat back, though. I can't do this. I'm scrolling down. Copper Gorge cat. Hey, I got the first one right. Did I get the second one right? No. So we take the cat. Okay, now let's see if I can do it from here. We leave the cat. We go back and we get the wolf is what I'm guessing we do next. We put the wolf down and take the cat back. We put the cat down, take the peacock, put the peacock there, go back and get the cat, and now they're all there. Oh, I just needed a little start. I needed to know one and two. I don't even remember what I needed the duct tape for. Oh, the arrow thing. Oh, not the arrow thing. The pickaxe. <laughs> pick it's called a pickaxe. There. Good as new. Oh, sort of. Nothing happened. Hmm, this contraption is obviously powered by something, but what? What does this steam train need in order to work? <laughs> the train runs on steam, but what do we need? Y'all are really testing Streamlabs today, huh? The bot? I think some of y'all just found out about quotes, didn't you? <laughs> some animals wouldn't get along. Oh, see, that never crossed my mind. I think all animals get along because it's nature and that's how it's intended to be. <laughs> I don't know. That doesn't make sense either. There's also a cooldown on quotes, by the way. So that might be a reason the quotes aren't working. There's a cooldown. You can only do it once every certain amount of seconds to prevent this. <laughs> hey, Miss Mundy. This is uh, Last Train to Blue Moon Canyon. More questions? I'll touch bases with you later. My publisher thinks... We're in you. Copper Gorge. <laughs> Singing about quotes. I have to speak for the bot. 
Hey, how's it going? See you soon. Sounds good. I don't know what the cooldown is, though. I haven't, uh, for a while, weren't quotes being stored on the wrong bot? No, new, um, for a while, new commands that mods made were being stored on the wrong bot. Not Oops. this. Sounds like somebody's taking a nap. Not falling asleep standing up. Isn't that dangerous? I think that might be dangerous. I think that might be dangerous. Okay, dear chat. Dear chat is where we're at. How do I... What do I do with the rubbing? What do I do with the rubbing? Dear chat, do I color it? Is it a coloring book? It's not the puzzle I thought it was. Look at the book of samplers. Oh, I need paper. Oh no, I did the rubbing. I don't need the paper in it. I did the rubbing. Now I just don't know what to do with it. Use it to get a four digit. Oh, that's right. This is the last one I haven't opened. I thought I opened that one. Okay, thank you. I, we got a lead. I, I got you now. Thank y'all so much. Not this thing on the wall, do I? Oh, no, the book. That. Not that. Not that. The sampler book. <laughs> Which was on a, a couch. Okay. Y'all better watch out because I got big brain. Wisdom. Eternity. Purity. Maturity. Please welcome to the stage. Wisdom, eternity, charity, purity. So wisdom is... I don't know. I don't see that word. <laughs> okay. Um, now, e what about e eternity is the crown? Which is... Six. Well, one of the symbols might just be in here. Yeah, we'll figure that out in just a second. Hold on. Oh, I see. Wisdom is right there. It's the owl. Purity. If I had to assume, I think that was the ring. Purity. Oh, it's the harp. That's three. And charity is the dove. The dove. Got it. All right. Once again, raising the bar. <laughs> it's the other way. I went the wrong way again. I think. They got the... Let me tell you. They got their money... Their money's worth out of that little cutscene. Seven, six, three, nine. Uh-oh. Okay, so there was some rhyme. Wasn't there a rhyme? Did I get it wrong? No, no, no. Wasn't there some kind of rhyme? And the rhyme was like, these go the weighted scale puzzle? Uh, probably not. Seven, six, three.
Uh oh. She has four words for you. Words which, when translated into numbers and used in combination, will help power. So I need to use them in the combination. I promise. Oh, well. Yeah, dear chat, don't tell me the order. How am I supposed to know the order? I just, I just wrote it in the way. Did I look at the cover well enough first? I doubt it. No. I didn't. The cover of the book. Oh, duh. Oh, I remember having this exact same problem. Okay, dear chat, never mind. Dear chat, never mind. I remember having this exact same problem last time. So that's the bottom left one. So it goes bottom left. Oh, that's the upper left, first of all. Upper left. Bottom left. Upper right. Bottom right. And so that is... Wisdom. Dirty. It turned to T. And Bur Baskin. Oh, BR, Baskin Robbins. What's the only one that's left? Okay. Did this reset? Or is this randomized? Seven, nine. If this is wrong, we're gonna have a panic attack. More pipes, more pipes, more pipes, more pipes. Oh, this one's really easy. Was I supposed to have done this one a long time ago? <laughs> I, these are probably my favorite puzzles. I have to tell y'all. I don't like that these all spin at the same time. That's not fun for anybody. Mm, that goes up. Uh, now... How am I supposed to get all these things lined up so they get they, they go together? Oh, because that's supposed to go there. Duh. Oh, no. Oh, okay, good, 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 good. I thought I made a big old dumb mistake for a second, but that's just me being dumb. Classic Josephine. That should do it. Panicking for no reason. <laughs> oh, Better not mess with that puppy. <laughs> I, well, yeah, till I got to Copper Gorge. Hey, how's it going? See you in a bit. Sounds good. Oh, he's excited to see me in a bit. <laughs> Sounds like steam from the engine <laughs> is moving through those pipes now. Okay, dear chat. Nope, never mind. I can do it. I can do it. I can do it. Must be a secret to placing the stones. Okay. The eye of the tiger. Zircon. Amethyst. Citrine. Tourmaline. Period. Okay. I need one more stone. Back already? Ah. See you soon. If you need anything, just let us know. I got it. Y'all don't need to worry about me too much. I think we should go shake down that corpse. More questions? Well, I'll let you go. That would be nice. Okay, I need a gem. The gem that I need is a is a tiger eye. Is it on Dear Chat? Is it on the train and I'm just is that the one I need? Oh, 
Well, in my accent, Jim, Jim are pronounced the same. And also the name Jim, it's Jim, Jim, and Jim. We've been through this. My accent does not differentiate. Jim and Jim. Oh, it's on the train and it isn't the tiger eye. Well. Well, well, that is so me. What other one of these things have I? Oh, I probably want a key. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Well, I can't do that. But I have a I have a clue. Hold on. Nope. The clue wasn't what I thought it was. Ten. Oh, ten and ten. Yeah, you can see what gems I have. Kiradel, thank you for the bits. I appreciate it. I have purple, yellow, hot dog, that one, and green, peridot. That's a hot dog. Dining car? There's a... Oh, is it in the dining car? That looks like a fucking hot dog. Fartville, thank you for the bits. I've never seen Degrassi. Sugar Turtles! Oh, there it is! Thank you for the two months! Appreciate it. Not a hot dog. Oh, God. Yeah, exactly, Monica. It looks just like a hot dog. For a minute, I was like, why am I carrying a hot dog with me? Everywhere. Isn't there some kind of secret panel? Is there a secret panel? <laughs> I just think there's a secret panel. You, it's in here where the Hardy Boys are? What else is there to see? Hey, how's it going? See you soon. Sounds good. I don't know what that stone is supposed to be at all. Oh, chandelier? Oh, we really just took that gem. Okay, thank you. The foot of the table? What about the foot of the table leg? I look at the foot of the table leg. And then I break it and the table falls on them. There's a button? Wait, what? In there? Right now? <laughs> My voice just keeps getting higher. Buy RXEBNE. -E. Do it now? Oh, that's how Lori disappeared in the beginning. Is it a shortcut? Do you know what I imagine she did? Because she warped all the way to the back of the train car. Do y'all remember when you would go to the drive in at the bank? The drive up teller at the bank? And it had that little, you put your deposit slip in the tube and it gets sucked up a thing and goes to them? I imagine that's the top of the train. There's one of those pops and she just got sucked up the tube. Is this an Easter egg? So Lori pushed that button, slid the shelves open further, squeezed through and disappeared. Very clever. I just took her word for it. I, who am I to call her a liar? Who am I to call her a liar? I just believed her. She's rich. I believe anything rich people tell me. <laughs> Kit Kat Moss, thank you for the bits. Jenna Devlin, thank you for the bits too. I appreciate it. She 
She's rich. Why would a rich person lie to me? Next, you're going to tell me they lie on their taxes. Matt, thank you for the bits. I appreciate that. Then slid between... Yes, yeah, she slid between the bookshelf. Okay. This is the mare's foot. Or the... Is that what they called it? In the fingers. That scar. Hand from the deep is what foul mouth shall keep. Tourmaline. Peridot rests in the foot of the mare. Oh, it's cloven hoof. I can't. It's cloven hoof. Oh. <laughs> cloven hoof. It's a looks like a fucking hot dog. So that's a wing. Oop. Fixed on a star. Fingers that scar. I don't know what this is. Oh, is this a butterfly wing? I need to find the gemstone that goes here. I don't know. Someone sucked at art. Oh, that's a bird beak. Oh, that's a foul mouth. Citrine. That's orange. Is this citrine? Someone will let me know if that wasn't citrine. Octopus! Hand from the deep. Tourmaline. Oh. Amethyst. It was citrine. Okay, good. Amethyst is purple. What the fuck? Oh, I just spit. What the fuck is that? Now that looks like a cloven hoof again. But like down this time instead of up. I don't know what that is. I would fire whoever made this machine for me. Oh shit! That's... Oh no, a star. Okay, I thought it was a starfish. The eye of the tiger is fixed on a star. So, is the hamburger the... Is this the tiger's eye? The hamburger? Well, what... Wait, what the fuck is this? Is this the tiger's eye? The bur the hot dog? Sorry, it's a hot dog, not a cheeseburger. Y'all, that's still... That looks like a big, juicy sausage now. I don't know. What was this? The butterfly wing. That's a claw? This is a claw? Or are y'all on mobile and you're talking about the one I had two times ago as a claw? That one's a claw? This is a claw? Like a... <laughs> I'm on mobile and also dumb. What the fuck? How is that a claw and not a horse, horse hoof? Not penis. No, what kind of fuck? No, 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 no. What animal? Are the claws at the bottom? Is it like this? What fucking animal? Oh, I guess that's a claw at the end of it? I thought that was part of the machine. A bird? So these are the fingers that scar. Is this Zircon? I don't see three hooks. Oh, there's a hook back here, isn't there? I see this. Y 
You think I act dumb to get attention from y'all? I don't think that looks like a claw. I see it now, but these parts that are gray, I thought was part of the machine, not part of the thing. I legitimately thought this was a horse hoof. I don't have to pretend to be fucking dumb in order to get attention, okay? That's not who I am. I had all A's in school. <laughs> I don't have to be dumb to get attention, okay? That's not who I am, and I will not have part of this. I will not have that be part of my story. Break out the magnifying glass. <sighs> I thought it looked like a horse hoof. I understand that the other one looks like a hoof, too, but I think they both look like hooves. It would be hoof, y'all. That thing happened. The jewels must not be in the right place. You're ugly. You're disgusting. I'm going to kill you. Give me $200. <laughs> Shara, thank you for that sound clip. I appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, fuck. The grandchild of the da 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 Zircon, uh, so Amethoth floats in a hand for the citrine is what the found. I got citrine right. By a soft arm. Isn't a wing like a soft arm? Oh, yeah, I should probably check. First thing I should do is check which are which. Um. Horse hooves are... I thought horse hooves were cloven. You think this is a fin? You think this is a fish fin? I thought that was... It literally says an arm from the deep. Y'all have more than one toe? I have the tiger is fixed on a star. We got that one right. Zircon lies and fingers that scar. We got that one right. Citrine is what the foul mouth shall keep. We got that one right. Tourmaline by a soft arm in the snare. Paired up, rest in the in the mirror. So the ones that we think I have switched are amethyst and tourmaline. Well, that's my guess right now. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry, chat. Whoa, looks like I did something right. I'm sorry I got mad when y'all said I need attention. I need to be stupid to get attention. But I really don't understand some of these puzzles. That literally looked like a hoof to me. I'm not joking when I say that looked like a hoof. Do I need to light the lamp? No. Here we go. Now you just pull the thing. Oh, we're doing this whole charade now. Not a hoof and a holler. Darn, I must be missing something. Oh, is there a map I'm supposed to put down? There's a map I'm supposed to put down. You've played every Nancy Drew game and you think you beat this one without having to look something up? Well, I'm also having to entertain 300 people. <laughs> so, things can get a little confusing sometimes.
Let's go ask the Harvey twins. <laughs> it is, well, I also play these like a week apart, so I forget everything that happened. Like last week. No, y'all are gaslighting me. Ain't you thinking? Oh, you have to look so... Oh, okay, I got you. Y'all gaslighting hey, me into thinking that... Talk to you later. I'm being anything, just unhinged. Shara, thank you for the bits. My reading comprehension is not... Oh! Oh, oh, oh. I just spent a weekend with my parents. I'm sorry. I apologize for misreading. Cosmos, thank you for the bits. Way not way to go, Joe, with the with the sarcasm. Farville, thank you for the bits as well. Pigs are cloven. I know that about pigs. I know that about pigs. Uki, thank you for the bits, too. Not my 18 CDs. I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. Oh, God. Are we finishing today? Probably only 20 minutes. Thank you so much, Diamond Lake, for the bits. And Matt, thank you for the bits, too. We gaslight you just as much as you gaslight us. Um... Well, yeah, it's pretty mutually toxic in here. Hmm, yeah, it's pretty mutually toxic, I guess. Did y'all see that weird transition? It, like, did a fade effect. I won't keep you any longer. Take care. I thought I was doing pretty good at this one. If we're being honest and vulnerable. <laughs> Tony Baloney, thank you for the first time sub. I really appreciate that. It's What's great to have on? you here. Thank you, thank you. Uh-oh, Baby Olive's redeemed a say nice thing about the chat. Okay. Dear chat, I did miss y'all this weekend when I was gone. So how did your expedition to Jake's mind turn out? Well, as you may or may not have heard, I didn't find the mine. But at least now I know where I it is. I did Which is just miss as good as knowing where it is. Past tense. <laughs> no, no, no. Past tense. Y'all didn't get the subtext. <laughs> oh, y'all thought I said something nice. I did miss y'all. But now... <laughs> <laughs> For a fleeting moment. You've been a big help. Don't mention it. <laughs> no, I did miss y'all this weekend. I really did. <laughs> Farville, thank you for the bits. This sounds like we did we we just I think it sounds like Wonderwall. Oh, Uki has redeemed. Joe asks you a question. Dear chat, if you could be stuck on this train with anyone, any four to five people, we have a lot of screaming today. Who would those people be and why? More questions. Oh, I'll touch bases with you later. That would okay. be nice. I, w I need to relook at the letter. Is hey, what I need to do. See you I want to get the train moving. Anything, just let us know. I'm missing the map, dear chat. If y'all were a map, where would you be? Are right, those are all the places I can go? Right. There's three places on this. Oops, sounds like somebody's taking a nap. No, it's hidden. Oh, 
on the train. I was so close in the room where I get the gems. Did I miss a, I missed a contraption because I'm just not with it. Not the thing in the room. <laughs> Oh, yeah, y'all have to answer the question. Dear chat, if y'all could be stuck on this train, on a train adventure, a train venture, if you were stuck in that kabussy of the train, what four people would you want with you? I don't worry about the map. It said I was missing something, didn't I? Didn't it? Baby Olives, thank you for the bits. Not this. Kiradel, thank you for the bits, too. Yes, we all need a little bit of direction, don't we? I would like to turn this knob. I was close to it. Oh, does this print it? Do I print it? Is this a printer? This is not a printer, is it? No, this... No, it's not a printer. All right, dear chat, go to the... Oh, never mind. Go to the end of the room. Oh. This thing. Oh my god, it's what those fucking things were. Oh my god, we did that at the beginning of the fucking stream. Farville, thank you for the bits. I appreciate that. I hope they don't have to spell anything. I hope that's just this. Chat, we got there. All thanks to That's what she said. And you know yes. what? I, what was that? Gigi, thank you for the sound clip. I appreciate that so much. Thank you. Thank you. So remember when I was just making all those... <laughs> all those awful sounds. Well, now the game's making awful sounds. I turned it down. Y'all, this game is unpredictable. This game is either way too quiet or way too loud. That's why I have these volume knobs that I can hit really fast. Sorry about that. Jeez, mine must be somewhere on this map, but where? Sorry about that. <laughs> Shara, thank you for that Daisy reverb scream. I do appreciate that. Thank you, thank you. How how long do I actually not cheese? I didn't scream cheeseburger. I whispered what it. What the fuck is going on in here on this day? That part. Fashion for fashion. Hey, thank you for that. Oh, I better get ready to turn it down. This needs Jurassic Park music. Thank you so much, Passion for Fashion. Me lying down on top of that big gear and it rolling over me and fixing my back. Oh, Joe Hardy? What are we talking about? Should I do something? Should I shake something? Should I yell for help? I'm turning it down. This is some ancient magic shit. This is some WandaVision bullshit. <laughs> That's some All that for a single spotlight? Brimstone Canyon. Don't you look all excited. What's up? I think I know where Jake's mine is. Tell the engineer to head for a place in Nevada called Brimstone Canyon. Way to go. I knew you could do it, Francie. 
Not Francie, Nancy. <laughs> Here's hey, Shelby. When we get there, I'm going to make sure that We're you get to be the first today. one to check out the mine. I'll call everyone together in the dining car, and while we're in there, you slip off the train. Will ten minutes be enough of a head start? <gasps> yeah, I need That'd a head start. Think of it as your reward. Of course, anything you find in the mine is, well, mine. So if I find out that you've taken something without telling me, let's just say things could get ugly. I wouldn't get your hopes up too high. The mine might be totally worthless, you know. <laughs> she I passed. know, but I have the feeling that A thanks stool. to you, we are about to discover something huge. Great job, Amy. <sighs> Thank you. Oh. oh, he said the words. He said all aboard. Oh, wow. Well. Oh, wow. Well. <laughs> <laughs> the limit. Just a limit today. Hey, Brad, how's it going? He said the words. Not this. Gigi, thank you for the bits. I appreciate it. No kidding. That must have cost. Like, he could have just made like a single. <laughs> mm. Thank you so much, Caradell, for that reverb fart. I do appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. <sighs> Sounds like the train's leaving. Where's it going? Well, Frank and Joe will make sure it comes back for me. I hope. What? Hello? Ooh, let's role play. I'm, I'm Nancy in this gorge now. Hello? <laughs> There's snakes out here. I'm getting scared. Did we just lie to, uh, uh oh. <laughs> Nancy, back away from it. Whoa. I'm getting scared out here. Oh, well, we could call somebody. Oh, I bet we don't have cell phone reception. That seems like something Nancy oh, would right. say. This is the entrance to Jake's mine. Whoa, what's going on here? Jake's color wheel seems to be pointing toward purple. Wow, glowing lizards. Cool, but weird. Oh, we follow the lizards. This is a fever dream. Y'all, I have to tell you, this is just as... What was that? Should I kiss the lizard? Oh. This is... This is so wild. <laughs> Good God. Okay. It's quiet again. This is, um... Joe's lizards haven't moved in a hundred years. Not Lumpy Space Princess. You, I would think maybe a little bit of paint. They could have put a little paint on the walls. But they really went with, um... Oh, shit. Am I supposed to be keeping track of things that I see? I don't remember. We'll cross that bridge later. I mean, a little paint on the walls instead of lizards. The lizards look really cool, though. I gotta say. Very cool. Oh, is that broken? Oh. oh I don't think this is the right one. Oh, green. Purple. Yellow. Uh-oh. There's some kind of chamber on the other side of those poles. But if I move the wrong one, the ceiling will collapse. Jake was too meticulous not to have left a clue somewhere as to how you're supposed to move them. 
Wait, am I almost done? Are we just finishing this today? Let me look at this real quick. Oh yeah, this is like the last puzzle, huh? It took me... Th uh oh, I locked up the game. <laughs> All right, don't worry. The mouse is, um... Oh, oh, it's fine. It, it's unlocked up now. But I do need to click out of the window again. You were pretty much done. We just got it. Oh. What was that? Oh, those are the boulders that are going to fall on me. Uh-oh. Oh. What was that? Diamond Lake, thank you so much for the bits. Oh, you actually meant it. When you said 20 minutes. Uh, I accidentally paused the chat for myself. There it is. <laughs> is she okay? Is she going to jump from there? Okay, so clues. If y'all see one of these symbols, just shout it out. And I know I probably won't see it because there's lag. So it's really, you know, kind of y'all's fault, whatever happens. <laughs> you know, whatever. <gasps> oh, okay. Well, there's one of them. Imagine how tore up your ass would be. Imagine how tore up your ass would be. I know, it's loud. Wonder what that's doing there. Ha 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 ha. you. That's what you said. All of the wrong sounds are super, super loud. All of the very wrong sounds are very loud. Well, I got one of them. It says go orange. Well, that's just gonna lead me back. Where's that go? just led me to where I was supposed to go anyway. Oh, there's one. Another symbol. That's a J. That's how you spell my name. I've seen that symbol before. I think I made a boo-boo. Oh, shit! Let me turn it down. Not G for Jesus. There's another by the second one? Oh, no. Okay, so far, so good. Oh! I can just process of elimination this! What the fuck am I going back in the mind for? Okay, I'll just leave the volume low. Nuts. It's not that one. Okay, so far so good. Uh-oh. It's not that one. I'm going to release I'm going to tag this as a walk okay, through. So far so good. Uh-oh. It's not that one. <laughs> Okay, so far so good. I think I made a oh. It's not that one either. Okay, so far so good. Oh, what was that one? Uh oh. Mm. Not that one. <laughs> Nancy is tour up at least it like doesn't reset all the way that's real nice 
Uh oh. Oh, did I just try the same one twice? I should do them in some kind of order so I don't forget. And we're going to be here all day. <laughs> well, chat, sit on down. Woo! I got another one. Uh oh. <laughs> Can you just look it up? <laughs> Not y'all begging me for it to fucking end. Not y'all fucking begging me. Okay. Depicting where the planks are. Go forward and see all the planks with symbols. Jake left a clue on how to move them using the rocks with numbers. Depicting the places they're located. What? That doesn't make any sense. That's not real. I should be able to get through there now. <laughs> wait, wait. She couldn't already fit through there? <gasps> no. Jake Hurley, I presume? Me. Me after today. Camille. It figures he'd be carrying a picture of her. Oh, Ooh, I just there's heard. There's something underneath it. Jake Hurley, Postmaster Denver. Looks like a letter. April 14th, 1865. Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. Believe me, Jake, my boy. I can think of nothing more pleasant than touring the west of Georgia private train. But as much as I'd like to accept your invitation, the duties and responsibilities of my office forbidden. I cannot leave Wash. Oh, wait a second. Your humble friend. Abe. I forgot about this. Oh my God. Is Abraham Lincoln. It was Abraham Lincoln the whole time. I forgot that it was Abraham Lincoln. And he went, if he had just, if he had just gotten on the train. Remix. <laughs> Abraham, no. Nancy Drew rewriting history that if James, if Abraham Lincoln had just accepted James Hurley's invitation to get on the train, he wouldn't have been assassinated. <sighs> I've never felt at ease when I. <laughs> Not the Ford Theater. Not John Wilkes Booth. Oh my gosh. This is from Abraham Lincoln. And April 14th is the day he was assassinated. This letter must be worth a fortune. That's just what I thought, too. <laughs> See, what I didn't tell you when I gave you that letter Jake wrote She's to Ruth screaming is that again. I also found his diary, which is how I found out he'd gotten to be friends with President Lincoln, and that he'd gotten a letter from Abe that he knew would be so valuable someday that he always kept it on his person. Can I have it? Sure. See, I knew if we could just find Jake's body, we'd find the letter. And you did it, Amy. You did it. I'm going to be famous. Good famous for once. So you never really cared about finding Jake's mind? Nah. I mean, it would have been nice if it was filled with gold and silver and stuff. But this is what I was really after. And you followed me because you didn't trust me? I trusted you to find it. I just didn't trust you to give it to me. And now that you have, you know, I'd really, really be famous if I could say I found this all by myself. But even if I got you to lie for me, how do I know you'd kill I remember me? she tries to kill us. But that's all I remember. Oh my gosh. What if there was like this cave-in and we were trapped, but I was the only one who made it out? Uh, excuse me? 
Oh my gosh! That way I could not only say that oh I my gosh, you, but that I tried to save you. Only you did something stupid, and it was all I could do to save myself. Oh my gosh! I'd make the national news for sure, and people would say I was smart and resourceful and courageous even. Lori, you can't be serious. That's crazy. You don't understand. People are finally going to respect me. I have to do this. Sorry. That is so mean. <laughs> I'm sorry, but that is so mean, and I get it. Blocked. I'm trapped. Now how am I gonna get out of here? You can literally see the other side. Oh my god, this is the minecart part, Maybe isn't I can it? Get out of here in this. Minecarts usually go deeper into the mine, but pop off. But pop off, Nancy. How do I know which way to go? Oh, shit. Oh, that way said dead, so I better go this way. Donkey Kong Country, eat your fucking heart out. Resident Evil 2, the remix. <laughs> eat your heart out. Oh, Joe, want me to die at least once? We can do it at least once. I know y'all enjoy it. A death scene. Oh, ha! Okay. Well, it was just a bit of a tumble. Yeah, y'all's minecarts don't just have signs that say dead this way. Are minecarts even real? Like... Did they ever exist? Is this happening? I've never seen one either. I've only seen them in video games. I've also never been to a mine. Why would they... Why would they have the death option? I guess just the worker is over it that day, they can pick to go the wrong way. Ooh, that one give, didn't give me much of a chance. Okay. How long is the minecart? I think we've been going more down than up. I don't think this is gonna get me out of the mine. Oh, did I have to make a choice there? I didn't see a choice. Ah! <laughs> oh, I thought that was her guts you heard. Lori, are you all right? Her guts. Nancy, is everything okay? It is now. As soon as we discovered you and Lori weren't on the train, we jumped off and hightailed it back here. What no, the jumped off? Going on? Where's the train? I'm sure Lori will be glad to tell you all about it. Darn you, Natalie. It's Nancy. Death there to all of them. Oh. Oh. It turned out to be. When her father heard that she'd tried to seal me up in that mine, he canceled all her credit cards. Fashion for fashion. On, Shay Lori TV, thank you for those. I do appreciate crying. it. Tino Balducci told reporters that he knew what Lori was up to all along and said he let Frank, Joe, and me solve the case so we amateurs could enjoy his limelight. Joe was just about to belt him when a big argument broke out between John Gray and Charlena over whether John had really recorded Camille's ghost. She started calling him a crackpot, and then he started calling her a hack. Then, well, let's just say that soon the press hey, was no longer interested in what in Tino had to say. As for Jake Hurley, it turns out that his letter from A. Thank Lincoln you, Silas, my brother. Fortune. I appreciate Pretty it. ironic, huh? Jake spent his whole life searching Ugh. for gold when all along he possessed something far more valuable. His uncanny knack for making friends. Love, Nancy. Oh, what did I win? You've been awarded the title of... Hanging with the Hardys for spending maybe a little too much time with Frank and Joe. <laughs> Not that. Have you ever been to Paris, France? Well, preparez-vous, because that's where my next mystery adventure takes place. I'm going to be the assistant to Minette, a famous fashion designer. I'll be working undercover to find out why she's been acting so peculiar lately. Throwing tantrums, firing people. 
She's even started wearing a mask for no What's this apparent windmill? Reason. Oh, that the was where she lived. Spooky looking centuries old Moulin. That's French for windmill. Of course, that doesn't have anything oh, to do office. with the strange behavior. Or does it? Only one way to find out. Help me solve my next case. Danger by design. A la prochaine. The game really set up. We clocked you, sis. Fartville, thank you again for the bits. Gigi, thank you for the bits. Matt, you always get a headache. <laughs> no, you always get a headache, Mitchell. Thank you again. Kick at Moss, thank you so much again. Oh, not this. Passion for passion, thank you for the bits. Yes, Leah, thank you for the bit. Not the fairy godmother chase scene. Cosmos, thank you for the bits. Is that the same sound effect as the Shadow Ranch cake? I love that. Jenna Devlin, thank you for the bits too. I do appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. We did it. Not this, Jort. You missed the whole thing. Um, I will tell you this. Oh, what am I going to tell you? I don't remember. Oh. Our next Nancy Drew game will be next month. We'll do another senior detective one if we hit the sub goal. I've got that, uh, the sub goal this week or this month. So, um, we'll have to decide which one is next. It's about time for me to replay Danger by Design, honestly. I loved it. We played this one a lot. Uh, I think I did this one a lot faster than I did the first time around. I remembered some things, and then, um, I really do appreciate the help. I'm sorry if I was a little too sassy today. I apologize. Um, Sea Bear, thank you for the 18 freaking months. I appreciate that so much. Better late than never. May Morgan, thank you again for the bids. Oracle with the 17 months. Kit Kat Moss, thank you for the bids. Oh, yeah. Maybe we'll do um, Secrets Can Kill, the original one. We might do Secrets Can Kill, the original one. I'll, I'll work on seeing if I can get it, this to work in my uh, USB CD-ROM. Passion for Fashion, thank you for the bits. Farfield, thank you for the bits too. Shadow Ranch for Pride Month? Oh my god. Okay, we have to do... Well, I was thinking that or Soren. Soren for Pride Month? I was a little sassy today, I apologize. Uh, Soren, the true, our true Nancy Drew gay villain. Be gay, do crime. Oh. Tomorrow, so tomorrow's Wednesday. Stay tuned, I'm not sure what I'm doing quite yet. Um, Thursday, did I have us down for the Am I the Asshole? Um gavel cam stream and friday we're doing an after a later afternoon stream of legend of zelda tear of the kingdom tearing the kingdom so stay tuned for that too is there a queer person in shadow ranch all of them mama dave especially in my head canon so yeah Tearing up the kingdom. Yeah, Zelda will be fun. I think I said I was going to start at about 6 p.m. I don't remember quite what time I said, but uh, the schedule's posted on Discord and Twitter. Okay. Well, that's all for today. Yeah, this is going to be a fun week. I'm excited. It's good to be back after taking a, a couple days off, but um, it's nice to be back. Okay, I'm ending. I'm ending it. <laughs> I gotta do the podcast like right after this too. I'm on it. Okay, we'll play the outro music. Oh. Shout out to Abraham Lincoln. Thank you guys so much for being here. Thank you for all the bits, donations, subs, gift subs, wonderful Patreon patrons. Y'all the reason I get to do this. Thank you to the mods for keeping us up, keeping it all together. <laughs> Kick it, 
Oh, thank you again for the bits. Uh, love y'all so much. Stay safe. Stay hydrated. Take care of yourselves. Exhibit self-care. And I will see y'all on uh, potentially tomorrow, but definitely Thursday. Thank you again, Jenna, for the bits. I appreciate it. Bye.